Um, what the? F Hold up, sorry. Um, what the fuck was that? What in the actual fuck was that? What type of fucking performance was that? I'm trying to fucking figure out what the fuck I just watched. I just wasted 90 minutes of my fucking life watching some bullshit performance. I don't fucking understand what I just watched. What the fuck did I just witness? What sort of... I'm, 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 I'm lost to the, to the sense of what the fuck just happened. What the fuck just happened? What the fuck did I just witness? What the fuck did I just see? Like... Everything was fucking poor until the substitution substitutes came on. What the fuck did I just watch? Again, they understand this is the only competition that we can win a trophy in. This is the only competition that could get us back into Champions League. And they perform like that. What the fuck was that? I don't understand what the fuck I just saw. I don't understand what the hell I just watched. What the fuck is going on? Like, why is it that a game that we should win easily, hands down, we've just fucking drawn? We just fucking drew one a game that we should have won, a game where we should have we should easily been like, alright, cool, second half, second leg, we go to them, we are chilling, we are good. We are doing great. We are doing fantastic. But instead, we're draw. We've drawn this fucking game. We've let's not even talk about the chances that we've had that should have gone in. That should have been a goal. I'm talking about the whole overall performance as a whole fucking squad. Fucking poor. Absolutely piss poor. Absolutely shit. I don't know what the fuck was going on there. I'm fuming. I am pissed off. You know what? In my eyes, what's going to happen? We're going to lose to fucking Sheffield United on Sunday. The way that we just performed, to the team that is the bottom of the table, we're going to lose to Sheffield United on Sunday. Because of that fucking performance, I don't understand what the fuck I just watched. I wasted help. I wasted time watching them play, thinking, yes, we are going to win this game. We are going to go into second leg. We are going to be relaxed. We are going to be cool. We've got, the, we've got this game handled. It didn't happen. It did not fucking happen. What the fuck was that? What the fuck did I just watch? Like I said, you fucking missed a, got a chance. Beautiful chance. Saka, you missed a chance as well. Like I said, you missed, technically you missed two, you missed, I don't, I'm not feeling great and I just wasted 90 minutes watching some bullshit fucking football, yeah, by a team I fucking love, by players that are absolutely fucking horrible right now, I don't understand it, you understand that this is our only chance to get back into the Champions League and we fucking threw it away, for what reason, why the fuck did we play like this? Like, team selection, I still didn't understand. Why the fuck did we not make substitutions at the 60th minute? Why didn't we make substitutions earlier? I'm, I'm putting the blame on Mikel as well. The players played absolutely shit. But why did he not make the substitutions when we needed the substitutions to fucking happen? Martinelli came on, the, game of, the way the game played was changed. Aubameyang, Pepe, El Nelly came on. Everything changed. We played a lot faster. We played like we wanted to fucking win. I, I'm, I'm, I'm just in absolute confusion. I'm in. I don't get it. I don't fucking understand where, where the players' heads are at. Um, second leg is going to be a fucking battle. Because we have to go now. We have to go to Slavia Prague and actually win. We have to win. They have the fucking away goal now. We have to we have to win that game. If we don't win that game, it's over. Our season's over. We're not in Europe we're not in Europe next year. We don't win a trophy this year. We don't have a chance to win a trophy this year if we lose the next if we lose next week Thursday. I'm saying it how it is. And I've been saying I've been saying it for a while. 
Sometimes I don't feel like we deserve to be in Europe next year. The way that we've been playing. And that performance there is exactly the reason why I've been saying this. Quite frankly, I don't care anymore. Because we're playing absolutely shit. It's a game that we must win. We should have won that first leg. We should have won that first leg. If we had won that first leg, we could have been chilling in, come, when we go back to um, Slavia Prague. But now, we have no choice. We have to win that game. Either way, it's a do or die. They've got the away goal. We don't have a away goal. We have to win that game. We have no choice. Piss poor performance by everyone that started that game. Every single person. The only person that I could say that was great was Leno because he had to do so much. He had to save. Leno played best out of all of them. Gabriel and Holding, yes. Bellerin, yes. Cedric, you put us under pressure. Clear the ball out. Don't fuck it. I don't. I, I just don't understand. It's such a fucking piss poor performance. I'm sorry, yeah. I'm an Arsenal fan. I'm always an Arsenal fan till I die. That's where I will always be. That's where I, my, I will always. That's the team that I always support. Always, I will always support that team. This team right here. Always, no changing whatsoever when it comes to the Premier League or any sort of soccer or football. Arsenal is the team that I will support. But you know what? We're fucking poor. That was fucking shit. Yeah, like I said, you had chances to score. You fucked that up. How did you fuck that shit up? I don't get it. I still don't understand how you fucked that shit up. Willian, I, 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 I don't. I can't even bother to waste my time. I can't. I can't. I don't understand what's going on in some of these players' heads. I don't. I'm going to be real. I don't get it. I don't understand. I don't see where, why and where we're making, what the mistakes are. Martinelli should have started that game. It should have that. That's what should have happened. But instead, we're starting players that haven't played for a while. We're starting players that don't even seem like they're hungry to play. That was poor. That was pathetic. It was. It was absolutely a shit show. We had to wait for the substitutes to come on to actually make an impact in the game. That's what we had to do. We had to wait to the 80, what, 85th, 86th minute to score a goal. Why? Why is it always then? Why is it later on when a substitute comes on that things have to change? I'm tired of this fucking team of doing the same fucking bullshit every single time. Why? For what reason? For what purpose? I'm tired. I'm done. I give up. I don't really understand. Yeah, 86 minute. We had to wait to the 86th minute to get a goal. A Bamiyang assisting Pepe. Two substitutes that came on in the 80th minute. They're the reasons why we've got that one goal. They're the reasons why we're not so deep in a hole. Are you see? Are you are you are you listening to the bullshit that I, that's coming out of my mouth right now? We had to wait until the 86th minute because of two substitutes that came onto the field to score a goal that, that is laughable. And there's different levels to this shit that Arsenal do. There's different levels. There is Arsenal that play fantastic. Like, let's go to the middle, yeah? Cool. This is basic Arsenal. Arsenal basic. Basically, we are standard. We can play. We can keep up with, with teams. We can do what we got to do. Arsenal up here, past the screen. This is Arsenal where we control the game. We score goals. We put pressure on teams. That's what we did against Tottenham. That's what we did against Leicester. Then we come down to the Arsenal that played tonight. We come to the Arsenal that showed some, for some reason showed no passion for 70 minutes. It looked like there was no passion for 70 minutes. No one wanted to win this game. No one wanted to. No one wanted to potentially win a trophy or get to the semi-finals. It's the Arsenal that 
make the same fucking mistakes over and over and over again. It's the same Arsenal that when we have a lead, decide to still play from the fucking back. Clear the fucking ball. Why are you giving them a corner in the dying minutes of a game? The dying minutes of a fucking football game, you give the team a corner. A corner. Anything can happen from a corner, you know. Oh, look, they scored. Oh, yes, anything can happen from a corner. Why do we keep doing the same shit? Over and 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 over again. It's getting to the point where... What's the point? What's the fucking point? It's annoying. It is pointless. It is shameless. It is absolutely pathetic of what we just did. Same Arsenal. We can't... What? Do we not know how to take all victory? Do we not know how to win? Do we not know how to score goals? Apparently, it seems so. It seems so. This isn't the team. Look, this isn't the team that, that, that went on. This isn't. Look, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not stupid. I'm not. I know. I know where we are. I know where we are as a team. I know that we're not fantastic. Like, we just do stupid shit, and I'm tired of it. And they they shouldn't, bro. Why are we giving them a corner in the dying ends of a game? I'm t- like, the, if we play like this against Sheffield when United, yeah, best believe, expect to lose. Expect to lose. If we play like this against Sheffield United, expect to lose. I'm not even being, I'm, I'm being serious. Expect to fucking lose that game. We need to step up a fucking gear for the last eight games of the Premier League. We need to step up again for this fucking second leg in Prague. We cannot go through this. We cannot. It's piss poor. It's fucking embarrassing. I'm over it. I'm tired. And you know what? This team gets your hopes up and then they just snatch it away. Why do people have hopes up anymore? What's the point for Arsenal? What's the point? Having having excitement and pride in this squad just hurts. It hurts. It, it, it there's it's like it just hurts, man. It fucking hurts. It gets to that point where you just question everything of this squad and this team because. I don't know. Um, I I just don't. I just don't know. I don't know. Like Martinelli needs to start games. Pepe needs to start games. When Saka came from an injury and he still started above Pepe. Like I'm sorry. I love Saka as a player, but Pepe should have started this game. Pepe hasn't been injured. Why would? Why are you starting someone that's just come from an injury to start this game? You know what? Thank you. Thank you all. Uh, sh- please share the video. Hit us a like. Help me with the algorithm. Get me seen more out there in the world. Um, again, thank you all for sharing. I will see you for the preview for Sheffield United versus Sheffield United and Arsenal preview. Um, yeah. I, 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 I don't know what else to say. Um, I'm not even... I'm not even as shocked. I'm just sort of now fed up. I'm sort of pissed off. But again, I'm going to end up watching the games regardless of how pissed off I am of the previous game. But again, thank you all for watching. Please share the video. Give us a like. Give me a like, please. Um, Let me help you. Help me out with the algorithm. Um, Yeah. Thank you all. Stay safe. And I'll speak to you all soon. (laughs) <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you all. I don't know. I just got a laugh. Thank you all for being here. Thank you and bye. <laughs>